When people think of sports in the tri-state, the first thing that comes to mind is probably football. But how often does roller skating come into the mix? Eyewitness News' is Desherry McBroom sheds some light on a sport that is making waves around the Evansville community. You know, I have hit someone hard enough that the wheels came off their skates. For the last 16 years, Women's Demolition City has used a little force to get exactly what they want, and they aren't showing any signs of letting up. Roller Derby is made up of two 30-minute halves full of action, and Demolition City is ready once again to make their presence felt. Full contact, full hard-hitting action. Um, it is a full contact sport, basically NASCAR and football and roller skates, but you can expect hard hits, you can expect big falls, you can expect people getting back up, skating their hardest, uh, just having a great time. Comprised of a team with many veterans, they also welcome some new players and transfers from other teams. We have a lot of new skaters that are just now learning, coming back from COVID. We have a lot of new recruits, people that are just learning how to skate, uh, a lot of new and excited teammates. So we're, we're still kind of in the beginning stage of developing the team, but th there's been a lot of growth and a lot of improvement over the season. But now, as they prepare to return in front of their home crowd in Evansville, the team says they're ready to not only get the win, but have the place rocking. Uh, that is where we started playing. It's a really cool venue. Uh, roller Derby at the Coliseum is kind of, you know, kind of goes with the Coliseum and wrestling. So uh, we're happy to be back there and we would love to just pack it out this weekend, see some people from around the community, uh, you know, get people back into the spirit of roller derby. The ladies will suit up and be in action this Saturday at Veterans Memorial Coliseum in Evansville to Sherry McBroom, Eyewitness News.